everyone, it's Allie from Titan, and welcome back to my channel. Today, we have something quite fun. I will be opening a box of the 2019 Top Star Wars Masterwork. When this set came out, we did open a handful of cases for the shop, but we did have some single boxes left over. We've sold some cases in the shop, and we've reordered some, and we have some more. But this is from, like, a different wave of our original opening, so hopefully we'll be able to see some different things in this box. Let me show you here. One of the coolest things to come out of Masterwork this year are the Ewan McGregor autographs as Obi-Wan Kenobi's from the prequel trilogy. Also some of the other cool things out of Masterwork as always are printing plates and awesome sketch cards. You can get really cool sketch booklets and little panoramic sketch as well in this set. I'm excited to see what we have here. This was the last box, last box on our shelf so we do not have any more in stock but maybe there's something really cool in this special hobby only product right here in front of us so i'm excited to get open get this box open and get right into it i've got my little knife here and real quick before we get started all right now that i'm down here in the corner we can get started so maybe obi-wan will bring us something super cool today what side should i open it from let me do a little slit here then around through the little little tape here holding it closed so two and one unwrap the shrink wrap and get the, this little thing here inside there are four mini boxes with one hit inside each there are two autographs guaranteed per master box and you can also get sketch cards little film cell relics medallions all different kinds of stuff in here so hopefully there were a lot of resistance, like the animated series, resistance autographs in this product. Hopefully, we can see some variety and not just get two people from the same series. Although, if it was two people from, like, you know, like, let's say if we got a Hayden Christensen and Obi-Wan, two prequels. If we got two of those autographs, I wouldn't complain, but I'd like to not get two resistance autographs. Uh, let's, let me move. You have them kind of ominously looming here. So let's start with this mini box, number one. This is what the packet side looks like, just like a foil wrapper. Put Obi Wan off to the side. Make sure I am. Let me scoot up a little bit so I'm in frame. Yeah, let's get down. My head is being cut off again. I was having that problem with uh, our Empire, uh, not Empire Strikes Back, our Return of the Jedi black and white openings. I kept scooting a little bit too far up, and it's like, um, you can't see my eyes. It was just you could see like. For the first couple videos, you could just see like my nose up, and then I think I fixed it towards the end because I noticed. Because we had, I've, we've been kind of messing. This channel has only been up like about a week and a half now, almost two weeks. So we've been messing with like the setup. Oh my god, I'm sitting right here and I don't even notice. There's a 101. There's a Wicked W Warwick, the Ewok 101, right here in this box. So far, this is a good box. You know, I'm just complaining about you can't even see half my face, and it's okay. Okay, <laughs> so let's. Put this Wicket 101 right up here. I want to be super careful with it. Don't even really want to touch it, but I mean, I can't not touch it. I work here. It's my job. But let's go on with the rest of the pack. <laughs> we have a Brew Lars, generally Imat. And we have our first autograph, the animated Clone Wars Obi-Wan Kenobi, numbered out of 25, the canvas parallel. Let me raise that up for you so you can see with the camera focus a bit. I should do that with the Wicket should really be better at this by now like i said we've been around for about a week and a half there's only room for improvement so if you want to see more of me why don't you hit that subscribe button but um i promise to bring better content in the future which i think this is this is pretty good content you know if i'd hold it in the center of the screen that'd be great but yeah gold 101 and a canvas autograph out of 25 this is the rainbow foil parallel of the defining moments insert for han solo or, no, I'm okay. It's not the rainbow parallel. It's just uh, very shiny. The rainbow ones do have more of, I guess, you know, accurately titled rainbow effect to them. I got a little overexcited there, hyping this this mini box up a little bit too much. But let's stick our base cards off to the side and get started on our next box. So first, in terms of Star Wars products, we just had the Return of the Jedi Black and White come out. 
We opened some really cool hits in that case opening, which is also available on our channel if you're so inclined to take a look. I think the next Star Wars product to come out is the Women of Star Wars. I think that's either late February or early March. Unfortunately, I think the distributors sold out of that product before we were able to order some, but we may be able to pick some up close to the release date. As of now, I don't think we're doing any openings of that, but make sure to stay tuned just in case anything changes. We have a Chief Chirpa base card. We have the Rose Tico medallion, non-numbered. Still cool. I actually like the way these look, and I don't like the way these look. Like, I think the medallions are cool, but when you're opening a product as expensive as Masterwork with such high potential for really cool hits as Masterwork, and you just get, like, a little medallion with a little... You know, they're nice, and they look cool, but, you know, you'd rather get something else. So it's a bit hard to say sometimes. It's like, ah, I like it, but I don't like it. And then we have an Asaz Ventures, the Dark Side Insert, DS7. Put that, in, put that in our insert file. And a blue base parallel, Queen Amidala, card number 13. So this medallion was our second hit of this master box, that hit for the second mini box. So, so far we have a canvas autograph as our hit, and a rose pico medallion. Let's see what box number mini box number three will hold. If the hits in any of these mini boxes can top our extra bonus gold one of one parallel we got in our first mini box. Now this does feel a bit heavy. I wonder if this is maybe something like an autograph medallion. We will see if it will so kindly open for me. No, it doesn't look like anything. Oh, I wonder what that is right there. That looks interesting. Oh, I think it's a film cell. The acid. It's kind of like an acetate border, I think, so maybe it's a film cell. Or maybe not. Maybe I'm just, maybe I'm being silly. But let's go. Code breaker for our base card. Super Battle Jump. Savage Opress for our The Dark Side insert. This one's a rainbow foil, number 210 out of 299 for DS8. Let's see if the camera can capture that rainbowy effect to it. Put that here. And yep, we do have a film cell relic, FCWW6. It's cool. It has Princess Leia in it. Let me raise that up, see if you guys can see. Sometimes the film cells are hard to see, but I don't think that's that bad. You can see Princess Leia there. On Endor with some Ewoks. With a little wicket, so the film cells wicket. Yep. Warwick. Or Wicket W. Warwick, number six. Let's put that, I'll put that here. Let me scoot everything a bit up, because I am getting a little out of frame. Next pack, or next inserts, we have Obi-Wan Kenobi, Defining Moments, number five. And a blue parallel, Jin Erso. Card number 81. Oh, time for the last mini box in this opening of 2019 Masterwork. Curious to know down below what your favorite thing out of this master box was. For me, definitely the 101. I think that's awesome. But maybe we will get a really cool auto in this pack because there are two autos guaranteed per box. Maybe something awesome. Maybe we get an auto plate. Maybe we can get a triple auto, a dual auto. Maybe a 101 auto, two 101 per box. Sounds far-fetched, but you never know. We have a purple back in the back, numbered out of 50, Commander Cody. Right? Yeah. But, ooh, spoiler alert. We have Jabla Hut for our base, L337, and our autograph is Lars Mikkelsen as Grand Admiral Thrawn. Cool character. I'm looking forward to seeing what they do with the rest of Thrawn's story. Hopefully Dave Filoni can fill us in on what we should expect to see whether it be an animated series or if they can get timothy zahn to write some more books for that i know timothy zahn has said he's interested in exploring that but for now that's kind of in the hands they haven't given like any like an okay for him to go through with that so i'm sure dave filoni has some ideas that i'm really curious to hear but for next insert we have heroes of the rebellion k2so hr15 and the purple parallel commander cody very cool. So definitely awesome box to open. If I had purchased this on my own, I would definitely be happy with this. I think the value is definitely there to cover the cost of the box with a one-of-one -one gold parallel and 
a cool canvas auto out of 25. Very nice. So I would definitely have been happy with this box if I had purchased it myself. I know sometimes, especially with this year's masterwork, for some reason, even though it has like a lot of cool hits, unfortunately, the value isn't there a lot of the time. But personally, like I said, I would be happy if I had purchased this box for myself. But of course, this was for the store. I just somehow convinced my boss to let me open it on camera for your viewing pleasure. So if you're interested in any of these cards you see in this video, you'll be able to find it in our eBay store, which you can find the link down below in the description. Make sure to check it out. We have tons of cool Star Wars and tons of cool sports cards, which speaking of sports cards, sports season is quickly approaching. We will be opening tons of more sports products on the channel, especially in February. We have the big release of Top Series 1 Baseball, so make sure to stay tuned for that. And today I will also be doing a quick video on some packs of the 2019-20 Panini Prism Basketball. So if you like basketball, make sure to check that out as well. But for now, I'm going to work on getting this Gold 101 in a safe location. Make sure nothing can happen to it. Thankfully, I'm not super clumsy, so I should be able to manage putting that in magnetic with no issues. But I will get all this cleaned up and... If you made it this far, thank you for watching. If you liked the video, make sure you hit that like button. and lets me know that you guys are enjoying my content and I should keep it up. But as I said, I will get this cleaned up. And then I hope to see you in the next video. Bye! Do-do-do. Nice and safe, nice and safe. Crisis averted. Ooh, bonus content.